All right, reaction is coming in following an alarming report from the Florida Department of Education of state testing scores. That report reveals that 20% of all third graders in the state of Florida are at risk of being held back. In order to move to the fourth grade, students need to score a two or higher on the Florida Standards Assessment Language Arts Test. 25% did not here in Duval County. We also looked at the lowest performing schools, and it turns out that one has had documented histories of struggles. News for Jack's reporter Ashley Harding spent the day at Lake Forest Elementary School. That's on the north side, and she has the reaction from the parents there. Just last year, we told you how low performance at Lake Forest Elementary School led to the school being taken over by outside management. Fast forward to this year, the struggles continue. Numbers from the DOE show some of the school's third graders are at risk of repeating. It's distressing news for parents like Geraldina Steele. It's very concerning because these kids, they come to school and they try to do their best. And as parents, we try to do our best. Steele says her son is in third grade and has also special needs. She says while the news about the low scores is upsetting, it's not surprising either. The FSA results show Lake Forest Carter G. Woodson Elementary School are among the worst performing, with more than half the students in danger of being held back. In the case of Lake Forest, the findings show only 12 percent scored at level three or higher. Steele says better communication at the school could make a difference. If we have a better communication with the teachers, um, other schools that my son went, through, uh, went to, they had like Remind Me and Class Dojo, where you're able to communicate and see what the children are doing on a daily basis. Steele says she's planning to transfer her son to a different school to better fulfill his needs. Despite the newly released results, the superintendent expects Lake Forest Gray to go up as a result of that outside management. It's also important to note that some students who don't meet the minimum score can be granted what's called a good cause exemption and can then advance to the fourth grade. Ashley Harding, Channel 4, The Local Station. If your student was among those who did not score level two or better, the district will notify you. Coming up at 5 o'clock tonight, reporter Elizabeth Campbell is going to examine the exemptions and the notification process.